Hello investors, good early morning from Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. This is the Morning Stir Market and Resource Rundown for Tuesday, September 25th. Stocks finished negative but solidly off their support lows from Friday and Monday. The E-mini S&P finished down one point at 1451 after clawing back from the Eurozone concern drop. 1459 acts as the channel upside resistance from last week with a low at 1443 uh, support after this uh, six sessions of quiet trade to keep, keep an eye on. Dow futures finished down 11 points here on the day yesterday. New multi-year highs were made at 13588 during the session on Friday before profit taking. Tech stocks got knocked down with Apple lower yesterday, pushing the E-mini Nasdaq down 14, half a percent lower at 2838. New decade peaks were made Friday at 2871, and the Nasdaq did finish positive last week. Crude sold off yesterday, but it did hold above the 91 level from last week and six-week lows. Closed down 1%, 87 cents on the day, and uh, backed off a little bit. Long bonds continued this March higher with its rally recovery up another 25 ticks on the day at 147 and 21. This marks the highest point since the four-month lows were made on September 14th. The euro backed off half of a percent to uh, strengthen the dollar back above 79.50. As a result, uh, gold was $11 lower after being nearly 20 lower at one time, closed at 17.67. Silver finished the day down uh, 59 cents uh, at 34.05. You know, again, we had new relative highs on Friday. With this recovery from testing stock and oil support lows yesterday, where do the markets stand this Tuesday morning to kick off the trading day? Well, things are somewhat quiet. We've got this euro that traded below 129 for the first time in 12 sessions. That pushes the dollar up a little bit, uh, again with the uh, resistance at 79.50 and then 80 to keep an eye on to see how that supports these commodity assets. Crude oil is up 50 cents. At 92.40, up half a percent, uh, new higher lows, and that pivot point down below at 90 have kept, kept this slide in crude oil in check. Gold is up $2 after the profit taking on Monday. We're sitting at 17.67. Silver's positive 10 cents, back above 34, which is important to see if you can make another push above 35. Treasury prices just will not stop. They're up another half a point uh, here this morning above 148. The yield on the 10-year note currently is at 170, so it's had a pretty serious uh, uh, backing down here. As we get started for the day on Tuesday, the E-mini S&P is up two points at 1453. Dow futures are up 21 right now, and NASDAQ futures are six points higher with an hour to go before the stock market open. So to recap where we stand uh, right now in the current market action, crude's up 50 cents, the euro's at 129.50, back positive on the session, crude's $2 higher, stock futures are steady, with the E-mini S&P up two points at 14.53, Dow futures at the CME Group are up 21 points, right now at uh, above 13,500. Please visit our sponsors and get more information on commodities, futures, and options at morningmarketstir.com. See you early Wednesday morning for the Stir in the Markets to set up your trading day. From the CME Group trading floor, it all comes back to commodities.